So, welcome back. I am here with Zorak707, and he is here to check out this new ship of his. So, what's it called, first of all? The ZWI Astro. ZWI Astro. Okay, well, first of all, I'm just going to take a quick look around the ship. So, as you can see, he's got some nice use of this red wedging at the front with the blue behind to give a nice little glow and a grill effect. I really like that. Coming back underneath, we've got more cameras. Looks like doors, I'm expecting there's going to be some hangers to take a look at. So obviously a massive turret underneath here. It's a bit dark, but you can see the stuff going on there. Engine design is very, very trick. Let's have a look at this. So we've got lava with, uh, with red blocks and a black stripe, which gives a really nice effect at a distance. It really does. That sets off a very nice sort of pulse engine effect really works. Simple lines, looks like octagonal design I guess but elongated. Tower's really nice, leather mass up on the top, got this wiring, I'm loving this wiring stuff, I'm gonna have to have a bit of play with that. Okay so here we have that red band around the comm tower which is a star, I like that detail and the red slide, yeah it's got some nice detail in here, I mean it's a simple shape, but there's enough going on. <coughs> are these fighters or turrets at the side here? Um, the small little ones, those are just little turrets. Little turrets. Okay there it is, Astro, it's written on the side, I'm hoping the other side is going to be lit a little bit better. Yeah, so this texture pack is favouring your choice of hull, <laughs> for sure. But uh, coming around here, got a hangar launch. Oh, lovely! He's got a launch rail. Ah, oh, that is beautiful. Yeah, I love it. I'm gonna have to take a little 180 dunk. Let's have a little run here. There you go! Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's good. That's awesome. I'm liking this. Right, so let's take a look at the inside because uh, we've had a look at the outside now. Is there anything you want to tell me while I'm build moving around? Well, there are around 18 docked mechs inside the bottom bays yep. for featherweight fighters. And um, one little repair drone, there's meant to be more, held in a very backwards um, hangar somewhere. Oh, I found it. There it is. Very small. Four large shellar turrets, as I call them, with 200,000 DPS each, I think. Completely reliable, since the fact that the Astro has enough power to supply all its turrets and its main guns when active. Has a five sector range, I think with its main middle cannon and has a nice bit of a shotgun array with it. Also pretty much unfinished, still needs a ton more shields added to it. So it's still well, a lot. You've got plenty of room in here. Man. Yeah, plenty of room. Also this was before I knew about generators so I need to probably go around and fix that uh, here and there. Wait, have you got... Oh there. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. This was just, I, I think I was tired when I was building this or something. But there was a, I was going to detail it, but then I noticed that the shape gave it enough detail. I just put so many alternating shapes in it that it worked quite well without any add-ons to its outside shell. Just so many different ramps that I put wow. on it. This is really nice, yeah. Oh wow, okay, so yeah, we found the hangar, and damn, what a hangar, yeah, this is really nice, I mean it's dark, but it's really nice. It's meant to be a full AI controlled ship, every bit of it is Jeez. meant to be unmanned, so it's not really got much of the crew com quarters sort of thing, but it does have crew com Quarters, just in case the AI goes haywire or something. Always need that little add-on, just in case. You know what, I 
need to do something really quick. Don't move. Oh, what's over here? More guns, more stuff. Right. Out of control. About there. Gift time. the outside shell actually added a nice sort of underside dropout to it adding a lot of detail to the shape so worked really nicely in the end radar dish. It took me a long time to pick up on the design that I wanted, so it ended up being quite simple, yet quite nice. Well, that is a gift. <laughs> right, so hopefully they won't be like, you know, 300 megabytes or anything, but I think I got it. Um, there were a few things that I did miss. There's some stuff in the side somewhere. Go to the back of the ship, above the main engine, and there will be a tiny little entrance to a small repair drone bay, which has nothing in it. Because right. I didn't I think I got it. Okay, so if there's anything I missed, that's uh, no problem. I'm sure I'll be taking a look at more of this ship very soon. Mm. So, has it got a main battery array and fixed guns? Um question has eluded my mind. Guns. Fire the oh. guns. I'm not in the ship, I'm floating around in my Oh, deck. okay, right. Well, don't worry about it. In that case, if you'd like to take your ship and vacate the sector. Mm -hmm.